Peru says it has placed two naval officers in detention amid claims they spied for Chile. CCTV's Dan Collins reports from Lima. The allegations of spying united Peru's political forces in a way that previous calls for dialogue had failed to do. Key opposition figures joined talks on the issue of national security. Military courts are trying two naval officers with treason and are investigating a third after claims they were spying for Chile. Certainly it's an absolutely reprehensible incident, shameful that naval officers could have made these kinds of leaks. Peru's defense minister says suspicions were raised when the officers made frequent trips abroad but were not able to explain how they were paid for. Chile, Peru's biggest Latin American trading partner, said it had not been officially notified by Peru of the spying case. If confirmed, this revelation could damage relations between Peru and Chile. In spite of improving diplomatic and commercial ties over recent years, the two countries have a historic rivalry, which could easily come to the surface. Last year, Peru won a key international ruling against Chile over disputed maritime territory. And the two neighboring countries are still involved in a dispute over a land border. We urge the military justice systems to act swiftly and, if it finds them responsible, to apply the maximum penalty. Peruvian prosecutors allege that Chilean agents paid the suspects for confidential information about Peruvian Navy surveillance on fishing boats. Both countries are major exporters of fish and have previously disputed fishing rights in the Pacific. If convicted of treason, the men face a sentence of up to 25 years. Dan Collins, CCTV, Lima.